Hey everybody, it's Rob from Flail Throughs. This is Gundam Battle Operation 2, and this is a guest video from Demolition Hound in the Gear of Zulu. Uh, this was most likely a Friday night, because we've got uh, me in the Zeta Gundam, Spidey Wing in the uh, Rigazi, and Moko in the Atlas Gundam. Uh, from that lineup, I'm kind of guessing we probably had some hard rounds before this, and we're just kind of looking for a... Uh, a little bit of a, a reset, a comfort food kind of thing, because at 600, Zeta is probably my best. Uh, I know Spidey really enjoys Rigazi at uh, 600, and uh, you know Atlas is always a solid pick. So yeah, that's that's just my guess, because yeah, some Friday nights, you know, we do well, some we don't, and you know, just oh man. A lot of times lately I've been making sure to get my dailies done before I show up just because that is one, you know, stress or removed from the schedule, um, removed from, you know, the necessities of the evening that way. Yeah, that way I don't, uh, you know, it, it's man, good neutral on that 4100 um, and good kill there. Yeah, just it's easier that way. You know, one less thing to worry about. And we can just, you know, all play together and have fun. I'm not sure why this person was standing still. Um, controller problem or what, but, uh, or maybe they were getting ready to shoot someone else, but I don't know. But yeah, that, uh, that did not work out well for them. That is a faz. Oh my. Um, yeah. Hit uh, demo a couple of really good, uh, solid times there. Took out his legs. If it can, uh, okay. It looks like somebody else is keeping it busy, which is good. He can get some damage in. Cause yeah, it is, uh, it is, uh, well, it's hard to fight without legs. Boy, the brain is just off today. Yep, looks like the Faz has finally noticed him again, and yeah. Really good start, though. We obviously won the first wipe at uh, 5190 to, like, 1000, so we'll see how, uh, where that goes in the end. But, uh, yeah, it's not bad. I had to skip out of uh, this Friday night because just, ah, uh, I keep forgetting I can't I can't really play games for extended periods as well as I used to because of my neck problems. And so after doing the uh you know doing the uh Springtide uh tournament and jumping straight into uh Final Fantasy 11 last Saturday, um I've kind of been struggling with uh with neck and head pain on and off all week. So um, I'm starting to feel better, so I'm just going to try and baby it so I can ca uh, hopefully, you know, catch everybody for FF11 tomorrow. But, yeah, it's, uh, yeah, it's going well, obviously. They've caught up a little bit, but uh, we've still got a lead. I think that was a Regazi Custom that just went by. But, yeah. Uh, okay, GPO2 uh, caught a demo with the Heavy Stagger, but that was... Uh, only temporary and it was not able to really press its attack so that is a kill for demo that is mark four and i'm on that yep yeah i'm pr again zeta i i manage fairly well i really want to get the new amuro uh, zeta because i think i'll be able to do good things with it but uh thus far i have not done so so i will you know i'll keep throwing uh tokens at that uh from time to time well, when I throw tokens, hope I will hope for it from time to time. However that works. But, yeah. Um, haven't gotten this week's either the uh, uh, Gyarodoga Psychomu test type. Looks like fun, though. Uh, let's see. Yeah, good damage there. The, again, the uh, Sturmfaust for the uh, Gyarazulu is really nice. It's basically a single-shot bazooka, so it has, you know, it has pretty good... Uh, uh, pretty good uh, range, fires fairly quickly, just generally very handy. Okay, uh, since that didn't do anything, I'm assuming it sank entirely into the shield. Which, yep, and very, very telegraphed uh, uh, beam saber attack there. Which, now I know what it looks like when I do that, which is entirely too often. But, yeah, it's... Uh, Sorry, yeah, just kind of uh, spaced out, but this is looking pretty good. I like that Zeta color scheme, too. I don't know if it's anything particular, but it uh, looks pretty nice. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we, we've still got about a 1,400-point lead, which, 
okay, now it's more like a 2,000 point lead, which I'll take. That's not the world at 600, but it's definitely a lead, so take that. And I am flying off to shoot something. I, I have a bad habit uh, when I'm using a flying mobile suit, which is I do kind of uh, s tend to slam the brakes on to line up my shot, which means I am very shootable when I do that. So it's you know, not the best move. Ooh, good counter by that Faz, unfortunately. Ha uh, split second too early on uh, the, uh, uh, on the uh, downswing from Demo. But Spidey came in and heavied the uh, uh, Faz to death, so... That was uh, that was pretty good. Um, let's see. Yeah, the Palace Athena is kind of uh, okay. It's backing off. That's probably for the best. I was thinking it might uh, uh, come up and try and drop missiles on the enemy base because the missiles on the Palace Athena are pretty uh, great. But yeah, given that everyone is uh, spawning in, yeah, good a good time to not be the support up there. Because, yeah, you'll, uh, you know, that uh, that GPO2 will just run over you in a situation like that. Oh, those decals work really nice on the shoulders, too. Um, let's see. Good shot there. Hit two of them. Only hit one with the uh, downswing, the Gundam Mark IV. And, ow, that had to be the big beam. Uh, and, uh, yeah, hit the shield on the Mark IV. But, yeah, so far going uh, pretty well. Spidey just tagged GPO2, it looks like. Uh, even with, uh, just, you know, even type neutral, Rigazi is a good choice to go after a GPO2 since heavy attacks do ignore shields. So, yeah. Looks like things are going pretty well. We are holding our lead. This is from far enough back I don't remember when it was, honestly. But, uh, and, okay. That did connect. I didn't think it was gonna for a second. And that, uh... That Mark IV is out of legs and about to get chopped. Yep. Yeah, luckily it landed uh, shield side down, so that was a good, uh, good hit. And there is a Methus. Yeah, I think it's the standard Methus in Methus Kai colors, which, you know, happens sometimes. I think I did that once or twice at, at someone's request. For some reason, the only suit I like to uh, disguise as another... There, there are only two mobile suits I actually like to disguise as uh, uh, other types of suits from the same family. Uh, one is the Gun Cannon Heavy Type D, which I put in standard Gun Cannon colors. And I like to swap the colors on the Zeta Plus A1 and C1. I just like, the, I just like both those color schemes, honestly, so that's more of a personal thing than a, a, any kind of subterfuge. But yeah, we have uh, we've done really well with this demo in particular has done really well. Oh, and there's a pilot just hanging around. Uh, don't think there's going to be time to take them out unless uh, Spidey just swung past. But nope, they just landed. So yeah, I don't think there's anything to be uh, sorry about here, Spidey. We did really well. So let's take a look. Um, I got top score at 4100, but demo did 147,000 damage. So and top assist. So. Yeah, really good round. And let's take a look at the uh, 4 and 3 and 3580. Yeah, right behind me. So nice. That is going to do it for today's Gundam Battle Operation 2. And that gives us an idea of when it was, since that was just the uh, Zeta Zaku popping up as one of the prizes. So whenever that was uh, available last is when this was. But until next time, everybody take care and have fun. Later. So there's a new trailer out for uh, Gundam Requiem for Vengeance that shows a little bit more of the story and a little bit more of just the uh, visuals in general. And it is looking better than I expected. I thought it would be okay, but I thought some of the earliest images they gave us uh, looked just a little bit clunky in terms of how the uh, mobile suits were shown and rendered. But this this is definitely an improvement. They They have... Definitely worked on that since they last uh, showed us any kind of uh, teaser. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to that. I, I want to catch it and uh, see how it came out.